Gospel of John, chapter 20, verse 21. As the Father has sent me, I also send you. This send-off is detailed in the so-called Great Commission in Matthew chapter 28, verses 19 and 20. Go, therefore, and make disciples of all the nations. How? Baptizing them and teaching them. When Jesus Christ sent these people out to make disciples, they were disciples that had been discipled for more than three years. So they were first mentored, and then they were sent out to mentor others. When Jesus Christ first met them, they were all spiritually dead. Then they got connected, they got baptized, and became spiritual newborns. Their master nurtured and nourished them. And slowly but surely, those spiritual babies grew first into spiritual kids that need to be served, and then into spiritual youngsters able to serve. At this stage, their mentor motivated them to serve and also modeled ministry to them. Only after that did Jesus Christ send them out to replicate the same. That is, to do to others what he had done to them. In short, make disciples. Unfortunately, many disciples of Jesus Christ never become disciple makers, spiritual parents, or mentors. Some remain spiritual infants. Others enjoy being spiritual kids served by others so much that they refuse to grow. Many Christians, however, become spiritual youngsters willing to serve, and then they become spiritual adults but not spiritual parents. They are faithful, teachable, available. They are involved in ministry, but they are not yet disciple makers or spiritual parents, mentors. What they need is a spiritual parent, a disciple maker, a mentor to help them become intentional and responsible spiritual parents, disciple-makers, or mentors. How? Identifying potential disciples or mentors and discipling or mentoring them. How? First, connect them to Jesus Christ. Second, grow them in Jesus Christ. Then teach them to serve like Jesus Christ. And finally, empower them to mentor or disciple others for Jesus Christ.